Hand clap to the master, guys. We're finally back again for the second reaction of this year. Today, Mr. Lick's reaction, guys. Big up all the Mr. Lick's YouTube family back again for this year reaction video. And of course, the newcomers out there, big up yourself as well for tuning into this year reaction. This is, of course, where I give my views, my reactions, my commentary on a number of things taking place in Dominica and the Caribbean and the rest of the world by extension. So, with that said, guys, definitely subscribe and turn on that post notification so you can get all the videos as it can come through right there. And then give this video a thumbs up, guys. I will, uh, pr please give this video a thumbs up right now that will help the algorithm of youtube to push your videos further and further so give this video a thumbs up or anything that you agree in this year video um definitely give this video a thumbs up and of course leave your thoughts in the comment box below as well don't forget to download the mr Lix tube app guys download that mr Lix tube app that'll be in the first comment in the comment box below and of course let us get into the video right there phone ringing boom bam let me make sure i can forward okay i can forward i think that's what are we? Where, where's the volume? Oh. First of all, black man, what, what, what is on top of your head? What, 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 what is on top of your head, bro? Like. You know, like when you use gel and you're trying to stretch your hair to, to stick on your head? It seems like that is the case. You might have receding hairline and decided to put it... I don't know what... I don't know what... what. I don't know. I don't know, but hey. There's Rogaine, you know, my brother. You can put Rogaine on your head to grow, grow back your hair, you know. There's operations you can do. I mean, if you're making a lot of money. There's stuff you can put on your head, eh? Take different parts and put the roots on front and make it look nice and re... re, re you know what I mean? I... I'm just saying, man. I'm just saying. I don't know if he's losing here on top and he decides to flatten the top of his. Anyways, that is, that's not the point. <laughs> you see what I'm talking about? It's like he take a mark and draw a line on his head. I don't know what's going on there. Maybe, maybe. The, let me leave that alone. <laughs> by the Minister of, of, of Finance, demonstrates in clear, clear terms, Mr. Speaker, that the Labour Party administration clearly understands that their future is not tomorrow, but the future is now. That's, that's, that's foolish. How can the future be now? You prepare for the future now, but the future can never be now. How can the future be... I mean, it's nice to say certain things. That's nice. You know, it's nice. The future is now, guys. We are living in the future. Foolishness. That's stupid. You, 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 you cannot live in the future at present. You live in the present. You have passed the past and you are now in the present. Heading to the future. But maybe it means something by this. Let's see if we, we can get it. We'll get into the, the situation in a moment, guys. There's something I, I heard there. Slight, you know, but let's get it. So that means you're looking towards the future, which means you are not in the future at present. I mean, that's simple logic. Isn't it? Guys, correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> you're looking forward to something in, in, in the future, or you're trying to build something and modernize a, a, a vibes of for Dominica, especially in the global realm. That's what you were saying. But that doesn't mean you're living in the present. You need to prepare in the present for the future. I don't understand how you come in and talk as if you you did not know what you were saying. It was sounding nice, though. It was sounding real nice. Mr. Speaker, we must not forget where we came from. That's the past. This country has been, has been battered by everything, by Marilyn. True. Which Dominica got a lot of help from the outside world, including the World Bank. I remember one time they were talking about trying to get um, um, an audit for them to be able to give Dominica more money. But um, from, from my understanding, the, the government them didn't want to do that because they might have, you know, squandered the money, you know. <laughs> and um, as a result of that, they were not able to get more money from the World Bank. Which 
But what happened to the what, who 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 that what happened to these people and the volume? I thought they they, they got a two hundred and fifty thousand dollars worth of, of elevating the equipment. Why is the volume going down? Which visionary leadership? People are getting bets so in the hospital. We still, there's not much job creation. This is why I, I, I'm, I'm, I, what's her name? I'm Ash, Ash, Ashna. The girl, the youth, the um, youth national youth um, council leader. I'm guessing. She was talking about the youth want jobs because we know jobs is something in Dominica that is hard to find. That's why people have to just get whatever job they can get. We go to school for you to learn, you get a degree, I and mean, then you're doing a job you had no, that have nothing to do with the degree you went to, to, to do. I was a simulation technician, you know, guys. I was a videographer. That was not stuff I went to school for. Then from time, I decided to become an entrepreneur in my own field and then elevate to further things. So... Don't get me wrong, the buildings and the stuff that have come together, the way Dominica has elevated, no doubt, has been back, especially after Hurricane um, Maria and Tropic Custom Erica. But there was a lot of outside people helping. And of course, the government of Dominica definitely did something in this regard, no doubt about it. But I think majority of the help came from overseas. So, yeah, and there were some negotiations I'm getting from the World Bank. But of course, that, there's, there's things that would, would have been put in place to help countries that have faced um, um, natural disasters outside there. So it's good that the government actually went out to seek, you know, help and possibly listen to different individuals. I thought he brought the, I think he brought the opposition on board and listened to some of the things that he was saying. Even him, um, 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 stated that the opposition gave some great ideas. So, I mean, you know, good to listen to people. Thank you for bringing back the volume. <laughs> the time is now there for Mr. Speaker. For us to embrace the opportunities created in the safe budget and put our energies into positive action. Now is the time for action, Mr. Speaker. And now is not the time for us to be put in blame, but for us to embark on a collective endeavor to build a dynamic Dominican, Mr. Speaker. But people, it's not on the basis of people not wanting that, you know. I think everybody in the parliament wants this. Well, they say they want this. They say they want this, but then we have luxury building, building in Dubai. With the Dominican money that was created as a result of CBI. Luxury, 28th story. I will never forget mentioning that there for sure. And then we've seen what is happening in Dominica. Most of the people building, especially the prime minister, has been in the mansion. Whereas people are going and looking for jobs. Create jobs. The way you can create jobs is actually utilize what Dominica has. You're talking about the future. We're not even in the present yet. We're living in the present, but we're still 20 years ago. We're still 20 years ago. Because 20 years ago, we were much better when it comes down to a financial standing. There were more jobs. There were more businesses out there. People, the employment, the unemployment rate was much lower than it is today. Take out any beats, going to skyrocket. So we understand all this. So we have to bring ourselves to the present, even though we live in the present. <laughs> We're not living in the future at all. <laughs> you, you know when people say, oh, like places like um, Dubai and this places there are 43 years were on the desert. No, if you look at them, you're wondering if that was actually a desert ever. Was there what if there was ever a desert there before? So all these things you need to, you know, think about. When you're talking, sir, everybody there wants, well, most of the people there want, I think generally speaking, most of the people want to see Dominica elevated. But the problem here is not on the basis of elevating. The problem here is we're going backwards. That's 
That is what will prevent the speaker. I'm the speaker. And 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 another you know, problem, another you know, thing, guys. I forgot to mention. We talking about moving forward and the elevation. When the opposition then complain, it's not on the basis of them not wanting better. You know, it is them seeing that you guys stated certain things in previous budgets that you would that you did not do. You keep saying certain things in budgets that you did not do. You did not apply. Yet still, you want to move on as if the budget of the before was completed. It's not completely. We put how much money for geothermal? Where geothermal now? Nobody know. They put how much money for airport, international airport? The money disappear. I think $173 remained. EC dollars, mark you. So, I mean, if you're saying you're doing certain things, you need to come with the actual evidence to actually push these things and say, okay, let's go forward because we have completed it. But if you say you're building, doing certain things back in the day, you did not complete it, you come in for a new budget, you didn't complete what you say you're going to do back, back in the day, you should, shouldn't you bring it forward to complete it this time? That is a problem that we are having. But anyways, guys, let me move on. It's not Dibi. Um, I think it's... Um, so I was told it's 9 o'clock. This is the first time I'm watching this video, guys. You guys can check this out yourself. But um, this is about the missing girl part. The, the volume go down again. But one thing I have to mention before you continue, you are the Minister of National Security. If you cannot protect people in the country, what makes you think that if there was some sort of threat outside, you could do something better? You can't even protect people inside the country. And the people that you are supposed to be governing a department governing over your ministry, national security, these people are fighting against the very people in Dominica who are then seeing things that are happening to them and they're doing some protests. Some even walk in, Magwesa. And they're still trying to come after people. That making sense? That making sense? No. But oh, but anyways. The people that have that, 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 that thing need to fix it. Or you spend how much money? And all you, that is the kind of audio we get in. But that is politics, my boy. You are there speaking as a representative for national security on any ma subject matter. That is part of it. That is politics. Where you think you're in a school, you're talking about living in school. You're there, there is another example. Uh, Nineteen seventy-six. I think that is the Rasta thing they're talking about. Rasta, yeah, I heard I heard of that situation. I'm glad that he mentioned these guys. We'll continue in a moment. I'm glad that he mentioned that. So back in the day, some sort of a abduction took place with two 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 girls brought in the hills. Rasta was doing their thing, what not boom bam. Now today we have a madman who kidnapped a a a, 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 a little one. He kidnapped the little one. My big underst the understanding I'm trying to get there, what has been done from 1976 to 2022 that would mitigate that these problems be solved for, 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 for abduction, <laughs> I would say the word, <laughs> for abduction, for taking somebody against their will. What, what has been the level playing field? What has been done? You know what happened back then and today you're still lacking resources knowing that people can get taken into mountains 
So if you knew that this kind of situation take place, it wouldn't be advised for since 1976 to get proper equipments. I mean, you were not there since 1976 as the national security, but you know that these things is possible. And not just utilizing that, but getting the right equipments for other security reasons. For other security reasons that can actually be, 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 be undertaken to better solve, especially knowing that little people can get taken. It happened again in 2022. Under your watch this time. Where you're trying to bring people back as if, okay, that has happened. And what? It has happened back then. So what? The question is, what has been done to prevent this situation from happening since this little little one went, went missing? Since the little one went missing, what has been done to prevent that from happening again? I reacted to a previous video of a little one talking about a Jamaican man trying to give us something to drink. If the man decided to go and actually get us something to drink and spike her drink now, and he then takes her to go wherever he want to do, go. Wouldn't that be under your... <laughs> yeah, 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 I tell you. We, we, we're not proactive in, 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 his, in these measures. We like to talk. We're just talking. I mean, come on. I wasn't there, but I know people in, in, in um, um, one who was scared as well. People say, boy, if I knew that, I wouldn't leave my window open. People were telling me all these kind of things, saying they're scared. You know, I, I even showed some of the, the, the messages that they sent for me. They were scared, so yes, people get scared. The big question is, what have you guys done to stop that from happening? Have you guys gotten the right equipment, thermal, uh, thermal devices, just in case of something you have to happen somewhere in the bush? You said he took the girl for 48 days. 48 Still today, they do find, do find, I'm, 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 I'm Kenisha, the little one. Still today, and this situation can happen again, and nothing has been done. Nothing. You come in and bring up a previous thing, talk about we living in the future, and you talk about the past, and the past still has no, no, no insight to the present because things are still the same. I mean... It, We, you, you literally say we've been on the road before. But when asked, what have you guys done? What? Has police received training? And you're talking about the very individual who took? Or you put the man on, on, um, on um, make the man, force, force the man to, 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 to on vacation or whatever you call it, forced for him to be removed. The man who did the, the, the pelleting of Kian. But have the police done training? Did you guys get proper equipments in terms of I saw in the same reaction? Yes, um, I did today self. The, take out, check out that reaction after this video, guys. The same reaction. There was a madman in the streets of Rosewell, and he's known as a, 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 a power. They say he have mental, they say he have mental illness. So okay. So that one guy have mental illness. And you've seen the guy with his arm. You've seen him with his arm. And that is a life arm. So that means all you still don't learn. That people who might have a little craziness going on inside their men in, in, in their mind. And you still have with a life. So if the man decides to jump behind you because he might know, you're going to put two, two, two pellets in him. So you don't know, get tasers, get rubber, rubber um, 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 stuff, get different things, and all you end up tiny man with rope. Because apparently all you don't have cuffs. I mean. <laughs> so we doesn't learn uh, we doesn't learn you come here and you talking and we see reality totally different from what you're saying as if the future is the present the future is present we trouble we trouble gasa so we did the same thing <laughs> the exact same thing only did before Tumba wasn't mad, he was believing his Rasta philosophy and it's kind of bush ital kind of thing. Which, of course, ital is a good thing. Rasta is a whole other thing because Silas himself was never an advocate for what is happening. But let me leave that alone. <laughs> Rasta, no, <laughs> when I come for it. But, anyways.
The girl is still missing. Yeah, because you guys lack the equipment. You guys lack the training. If you guys didn't take out the very madman himself, he would still be alive today. Given his medication, he would then be able to, you know, say what happened. And this is one of the reasons why I believe that maybe this was an inside job. Because why did you take out the only man that would know where she is? The only man that would know or post potentially know where she is given the circumstances that she would have maybe been handed off to somebody else who then decided to take a drive and go. And while we people looking for a for girl in one and think she probably on the way to Martinique the next day. And then again, you might need, oh, not, not, not just Matnik, you know, guys. I'm thinking of the ferry, silly me. <laughs> because people just take fishing boat and go, marry Gallant and Les Saints and Guadeloupe. And people just take all kind of boat and go. We know about Haitians traveling all the way to Anguilla. And Montserrat coming from Dominica. On boat that is hired. So you don't think maybe some rich person can just come and just take somebody. Maybe that's the same thing. The same thing happened to her mother. Disappeared. No trace. I mean, come on. Come on, man. I want to take this opportunity to speak up. For you. To express my gratitude to the police officers, the better women of the police force. Men firebond them, and don't get me wrong. Not all police officers are, are, are thing. It only took one to take to take the life. But the mere fact that as an institute. When you look at the, the, the competence of the police, everybody, everybody, nobody believes the competence of the police. Nobody has the competence of the police. Why is that? Because based on what we see happening, especially one of the instances that I always mention is about theft. We see man thief hinting on camera. <laughs> hey, it doesn't say yes, you know, guys. Man thief hinting on camera. And they still yet to be found. Man thing on camera with car in camera view. <laughs> and car still can be found. <laughs> Remember when the robberies took place in Jimit? And the robbers, the same set of individuals apparently came down to post modern rob. There's cameras. And nothing has been done. You are the minister of national security. And not saying no, nothing does be solved, you know. I'm saying certain things can be solved true. Another instance is the, the radio host individual. You guys didn't bring in front of court for, for them to verify what exactly was going on to see if it's true or false. Based on what we see, he's, he's definitely guilty. He may not have done the act, but he solicited. And that's why I said maybe some sort of ar arrangement happened where, where they paid the family behind, behind closed doors or something like that. And you can't say anything about it. This means the people are clueless. This is why people crazy, crazy himself was went out to Afi. Afi, I think it's today or yesterday. And talking about he's disturbing his business. I mean, <laughs> anyways, guys, let's continue. I thought it ended. What do you mean continue to search? You need to verify that. Hopefully he says he says what he means. The police department have assigned a team of investigators to look at every possible link that will be closure to that very sad story. Is that what is happening in the future or that's what happened in the past and you're saying what happened in the past? Pretending like it's in the future because I heard that the whole search thing stopped. So we all, as Dominicans, are praying and hoping that some closure can be brought. Indeed. Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, I want at this time, Mr. Speaker, to say to Mr. Honorable Hawks, going back to what the leader of the opposition said, when he made reference to the death to 
So you're talking as if it's not on record. Guys, this is why I'm going to end this. Because, I mean, it, 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 to pretend as if you cannot find the documentations on this information and mathematics is something difficult to see, especially the numbers is right in front of your eyes. I mean, come on. It's not rocket science. No, guys, maths is not rocket science. No, maths is addition and subtraction, you know. Irregardless of what formula I use, is addition or subtraction. Multiplication is multiplying, is, is, is an amplified addition. Division is a, a multiplied I'm, 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 I'm subtraction. Multiplied subtraction, multiplied addition. It all comes down to one thing. And based on these statistics, based on the GDP ratio to Dominica 105, I mean, <laughs> come on. <laughs> when it was UWP time, it was around 50-something 50 um, 50 percent of the debt of, of the GDP. Now it's a 105, 106 percent. Mark, you know, 105, 106 percent of the GDP. And now we're going to take money from China now. We're going to take additional money from China to build airport. The same airport that the Prime Minister promised. How much time? Guys, I'll be doing a video on that too. <laughs> That'll be my video tomorrow. I suspect I'll be doing two videos tomorrow as well. So definitely look into that, guys, because this is very important information for people to know. I know some persons say that they look for me. Guys, this is just why I give my views, and I want to hear views as well. Let me know if I'm wrong. Because I do things based on a common sense point of view. Not saying that everything that I will say is 100%, but it's common sense. When you're using common sense, you then say, okay, Mr. Lex, what are you saying? A little off for this kind of thing. There is this and that. I understand that people have, have stated this in the comment box, and I agree with them. Because why do my reactions not based? I mean, I have a knowledge of certain things, so I, I can think it. But if I, and this is, this is why the reactions are different from BRBPTV, because BRBPTV, I literally go into search. And I do that for some, 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 com um, um, let, let me not say much. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah. Anyways, guys, let me know your thoughts in this regard. Let me know your thoughts on what is um, Blackmore is saying. Does it add up? Does it add up? Is it just me? What are your thoughts, guys? Leave your thoughts in the comment box below. Don't forget to give this, give this video a thumbs up. I would appreciate that. And download the Mr. Leaks Tube app right in the first comment in the comment box below. Don't forget to check out the previous video so you understand certain things I was mentioning a while ago right there, guys. I'll see you guys in the next reaction video. Remember, guys, be real. Be positive.